This demonstration will use telemetry metrics provided in the inferencing cluster to create a custom network load balancing algorithm using Big IP Next for Kubernetes. We'll demonstrate how telemetry metrics provided by NVIDIA in their NIM inferencing stack can be used to improve overall GPU utilization and improve time to first token for users across the cluster. AI inferencing clusters are technical marvels of distributed computing and networking. Many different fields of expertise have come together in these clusters. Sometimes the integration points between these various technologies becomes a barrier to optimizing resources and user experience. Take as an example, network load balancing, the role Big IP Next for Kubernetes plays in the inferencing cluster. Once service monitors say a NIM is available, Big IP will start sending requests for inferencing to it. But what if that's not the right thing to do right now because of something in this complex system not normally monitored by network devices? What if a previous request has the GPUs allocated to this NIM backed up and we're having a growing request queue? What if a backend networking issue is creating memory pressure on the service? What if our NIM doesn't need to be fully marked down by liveliness, but rather just needs a break for a few requests to catch up? With Big IP Next for Kubernetes, you can define your own load balancing algorithms based on performance telemetry found throughout the inferencing cluster. You can watch telemetry from NIM metrics like pending request queues or KV cache utilization, which Dynamo optimizes. You can look at host metrics like memory or CPU utilization. You can look at GPU operator metrics like GPU core or VRAM utilization. Networking metrics like interface error counts or link state. These metrics can then alter the big IP load balancing dynamically all through Kubernetes. System behaviors could be modeled and we could let AI take over adjusting the load balancer. Let's see this in action. We've set up a demonstration of monitoring NIM metrics. Specifically, we've constructed an algorithm which watches end-to-end -end latency, uh, NIM KV cache utilization, and the NIM's waiting request queue depth. We've purposely caused a massively uneven loading between two NIMs, and the magnified gauges on the bottom right you see one of our NIMS request queue is quite full. The other one's much less. Uh, the other magnified window there is actually showing you the load balancer real-time ratios that are being sent to, to divide traffic between our NIM deployments. Uh, as you see, there's in the bottom right, uh, we're pulling the metrics in that little process window, and those pulled metrics are directly influencing the load balancing ratio. So what we should see is our algorithm pulling these two NIMs into equal loading. Uh, the request going to each one of these services is in the top right, and we should start to see that get to our standard kind of rail-based graph look. Um, if we look at it, it's starting to equal out, and there it is. We're pulling it in to balance. Again, this isn't some standard algorithm built into the big IP. This is us pulling metrics from our infrastructure and our deployment to better our inferencing service.